Taco Bell presents Nacho and Dog. Dog, hey dog, I'm sinking. Nacho. I'm coming, Nacho boy! Oh. My fishing rod, my favorite book! Thanks! Now when you buy a Taco Bell kids meal, you can get a toy featuring basketball great Shaquille O'Neal as Kazam. You can collect all four at Taco Bell. Hey, what? Ah. Ah. Taco Bell, fetch that, that food. food. Dong! From Touchstone Pictures, Max never went looking for trouble. Trouble just seemed to find him. And now he's got a genie. Make your three wishes. Who just won't get out of his face. You gotta want something, kid. I wish I had junk food to the sky. Higher, higher. Shaquille O'Neal, Kazam, rated PG. Starts Wednesday, July 17th at a theater near you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Podcast 118. Today is also Mystery Movie Commentary Episode 2. Okay there? Yeah. 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 Oof, man. You know, that number. And all, that, all that Russian talk. All that Russian talk got to me. Boy, you got, you, got, you, got a, you got a pill caught in your throat? I do. I have a, a Viagra. It's like a little blue one. I'm a little stiff in the neck. <laughs> oh! And we're going to do a movie, uh, a mystery movie today. We did uh, a mystery movie last time with uh, with uh, DJ, and uh, we did Get Even or Get Even or you know, let's not put a space between two words and kind of fuck up the entire title of our movie. <laughs> but uh, and it was also called Road to Revenge, by the way. So there's multiple different ways to, to take that movie, and it did very well. People seem to respond. Uh, number wise, uh, a little, a little too good for a shitty movie like that. Oh, well, that's kind so of. We're gonna do it. Today. We're gonna do it again. But this one, people have heard of. Oh, have I heard of this one? Yes, you have. Well, I have. Wow. You've yes. seen it. I'm sure you've seen it. I've, I've seen, seen it. this one. I've seen it once before. Oh. Um, and that was enough. Okay. So well, now you're gonna see it again for the first time. Yes, and we're we're gonna do something. Um, you know. There is a movie coming out, very similar, uh, in, a, in, a, in a way. And um, do you know what movie comes out on April fifth? April, this April fifth. This April fifth. Oh shit! So we did. We coordinated the two. Yeah, uh, Shazam. Shazam coming, Shiz- coming out. Yeah. Why don't you Why don't you type that word in? Oh uh, wow! The password to the movie. Wow. So, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, Matt has no idea what movie he's going to watch. No clue. If you watched the, or listened to the DJ one, he had no idea until we began to record as well. But this one has a password, and the password is Sunshine. Mm, wow. Look at this. Did it work? It's, uh, it's coming up oh, right now. About to, All right. Uh, so let's start. begin. Are you at 0000000 zero, 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 zero mark? Uh, I am now, yes. Absolutely. Right. Oh, boy. Oh, Ready? this is something. Yeah, let me know. Did you, me look, know. did you look to see what movie it is? I, I haven't yet. No, okay. I, I, I see that. So you're at black movie. screen. You're at, I'm at a black zero, screen. Zero, zero, zero mark. I'm at the zero, this, zero, this zero mark. Says. All right. We're going to we're gonna press play in at, at three, two, one. All right. Well, it's a, it's, it's a touchstone <laughs> picture. You know, it's, it's always going to be quality. Well, you know, this might be the highest quality production, I don't know, film we've ever done on the movie. Really? I, yeah, oh. even even Justice League wasn't as good as this. Wow. Interscope. Is this yeah. like the same Interscope? Like Interscope Records? Interscope? T- no, I had no idea what you're talking about. What do you think know. this is? What do you think this movie is? I don't let's see so far. Think it goes? Interscope, what Polygram included. Uh, a Paul M. Glazer film. What's he done? Uh-oh. Is this what I think it is? Ah! Oh! Because... <laughs> I am Kazam. Kazam. Wow. Kazam. Ladies and gentlemen, we're watching Kazam today. We are. Damn. I haven't watched this since the early nineties when it probably came out. Shit. I don't even I don't I don't think I've seen this film all the way through. Well, I bought a um DVD pack, had like 
12 movies on it and this was one of them and i said wouldn't this be great to watch for uh for april i know because april fools and well and, and shazam too shazam. Yeah. <laughs> shazam, yeah. i thought aren't you supposed to scream that you're supposed to scream that title because it's got an exclamation point at the end yeah shazam 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 well, tonight at the apollo <laughs> shazam get the hook because this white guy is not funny at the apollo have you, have you, do you remember anything from this? I know uh, mm-hmm. the, the kid, the kid who's in it, uh, wasn't he like in Warriors of Virtue or something like that maybe? Oh, no. with like the, the animal, the, the, the kangaroos or whatever. Yeah, the big giant wallabies. That I used were, to like uh, that movie. I used to like, I, I, had, I had some of the action figures actually for that. Yeah, I remember it was a big deal. real quick. I feel like they had a lot of like tie-ins with like either McDonald's or Burger King. Well, or see, I thought that movie flew under the radar um, when that came out. I remember watching it. I think it was like a direct to VHS movie. No, that movie. No, that was a wide release. It was. Was it th- really? Yeah, I, I, that's how I saw it. Was on VHS, and uh, you remember, he falls like right, right into the water, river, or something. He goes onto like yeah. a pipe, right? Something to yeah. to that extent. I haven't watched it really since. So. <laughs> Did it scar you? Did it, did scar it scar me for life? Like, well, they're kind of hideous creatures. They if, are. It's it's almost like how people get really upset about how shitty and ugly the new turtles are in the other turtles movie. Like that's how I feel about the giant kangaroos in Warriors of Virtue. But oh, that's what they were. Okay. Yeah, I think that they, they, they were kangaroos. more super. That sounds about right. Sort, you know, they were they were they were they were, they were down under. Yeah, but see, with the with the turtles, there was some kind of loving. I don't know. It was because Jim Henson had a, you know, say yeah. in the matter and whatnot. Yeah. But a, um, it, just watching this thing scream, which I'm, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah. I, so, so it's a screaming lamp and in walks this, look at this fucking badass. How walking. 90s is this? I know. You got Coolio on the soundtrack. I mean. You, and I got a little uh, white kid walk in. And, I love, and this kid's it. probably, he's probably late for class or he probably just shit his pants and he's looking for some, uh, looking for the bathroom where he can shit, you know, throw his shitty boxer shorts away. Oh, he's a cool cat. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people wore stripes in uh, the early night mid In the mid- 90s, yeah. Yeah. People wore a lot of striped shirts. I think I was also, probably. They also had these like that. vests on too. The yeah kids he's got like his kind of jurassic park tech vest thing going kind of going on this little fuck yeah yeah and that that security guard is pretty shitty as Jeff. yeah he's not good <laughs> <laughs> could it detect a child literally no not at all and while the film and this kid is going to get um he's gonna get the old russian treatment in the bathroom say jesus this is kind of it's kind of rough shit right here you yeah, get this- treated like this as a child no, I don't. I never got treated like this. Sadly enough, I was never put in the situation where somebody drew a green pseudo chalk outline around my body before stealing my money. And I don't know what they have planned for this kid, but he's got a set of chompers on him. Look at that, Look at that tooth. grill. Look at that fucking grill. That, that, that left tooth right there, that oh, front yeah. mouth one. That's, that's, be careful, kids. Yeah, don't, don't be like Jewel, the uh, pop singer. Yeah, wear that mouth guard. Yeah. <laughs> wear wear the retainer at night. You play the sports. Yeah. So I went, so he had a key, I guess, and they just gave the key up. Pretty easy. Okay. I thought he was a cool cat, but obviously he's a pussy. I mean, those 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 bathroom ruffians, I would be scared of. So. Oh, it's all it's all play. It's all play. Is uh, he got? Is he got a galaxy on his shirt? Is that what it is? Got the whole gal. The galaxy, the whole galaxy. is on this kid's shirt. Oh, he's got a very punchable face. Yeah, I feel like every I feel like every kid in every movie in the mid nineties just you just wanted to fucking I don't know you wanted to finish him off. You wanted to finish him off, and not yeah. in a sexual matter. No, 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 no. Yeah, not not in a in a Catholic that, priest matter. No, not not Father O Hulahan's uh, method. No, no, sirree, no sirree, no. Bob. No sirree. You know, it's funny. There's only certain like cities and states where the priests really like to get down on the little kids. Get down and dirty on the kids, yeah. yeah. You don't take the time when I almost got molested. Really? I oh, almost man. did. I didn't, though, unfortunately. Oh. Did you fight yeah. back or did he just say, like, too old? 
No, you know, you know, I used to go to the uh, the CCD as they called it. Uh, you had to go, you know, you as a kid, you went to the school. My family's not really religious, and I, I later found out why they were pushing me into it. It was essentially in case I ever wanted to get married in life. You know, you, you oh. go through that all. It's a whole scam. So, uh, of course. Um, it, they eventually, you know, came to the conclusion that it wasn't needed, and therefore, would it be okay if you know my my sibling uh, didn't. Uh, have to go through it, and I said, "Yes, it's it's okay." Oh, okay. I took one for the team, but he used to come up and rub my shoulders all the time. And as a kid, you don't really think about this stuff, you know. No, I mean, you're, you're probably you're, your back. you're probably feeling a little tight, you know. You, you've been, you know, being a kid all day. You're sometimes you're, it's nice. It's again, you need a little rub down. But he always would rub your back, and he would always come up to me and, and do it, and then leave, and then come back and touch me, touch me constantly, and the oh, back area, all the back, yeah, yeah. But he had a horrific bo. Oh, those are the worst body kind. odor, and mm. uh, and I made fun of him, and uh, he stayed. I'm surprised away. It didn't, I'm surprised it didn't like really go for that, you know. That sometimes well, those uh, priests like to be talked dirty to a little bit. Talk dirty. Well, that was quite horrendous, and I think when when a kid makes fun of you like that. Uh, yeah, he probably That's, killed himself. He probably did. He probably murdered himself, uh, yeah. which is okay. It's fine. I mean, he, he probably saved everybody else a lot of time. You know, I saw her recently in really? uh, the John Claude Van Damme movie. Was it Cyborg? She's in oh. Cyborg. She's the reporter, I believe. I haven't seen Cyborg in a long time. Well, I feel that's very overrated. <laughs> <laughs> cyborg overrated? A lot of people always say cy- Cyborg is, uh, is better than it really is. I mean, I know a lot of people really like Universal Soldier. That seems to be the one that everybody kind of goes for when in the in the Van Dam, uh, you know. I think that's the so one I was talking about. Oh, Universal Soldier. Oh, yeah, okay. I think that's the one I was talking about. Okay. I don't know why it's a cyborg? Was there a movie called one. Cyborg? Yeah, that's the other one with um, uh, Canon. Yeah, essentially destroyed Canon films. Canon, Canon, Canon films. films? Yeah. Oh. Canon films. A lot of things, you know, destroyed Canon, but that definitely I think was on the top of the list that or uh, that over really the top, or uh well that director Master universe maybe that director was originally going to do the spider-man film oh and when they went under um he kind of they had some i guess i don't know how, how it went budget wise but they were like hey you want to do so and so and they ended up i guess split the budget of spider-man to mm-hmm. uh masters of the universe and cyber so huh. That's how that kind of got going, but yeah, Universal Sor- Soldiers, I believe she was in. She was the okay. Order, and that's, that's one I haven't seen. That him, that was what him, him and what Dolph Lundgren in that one. Yeah, it's a goofy fucking film. Oh yeah, but it's it's an enjoyable uh, weekend. Uh, well, we can get away. We can get away. Yeah. You think these guys were in the back alley there jerking each other off? They might. I mean, they, he's got the guy, was, the guy was smoking a cigarette, so he just probably finished him off. They look relieved for a second. Man, this this kid is good on a bike. This camera work. I mean, there's some, there's some good shots here. Well, when you have Shaq starring in your film, you know you're bringing out all the yeah. the A cinematographers. You bring the whole. You bring that whole LA flavor. Mm. Ooh, man! So Kit goes into an abandoned building and finds a uh, shack. Yeah. Oh, see what you did there. It's gonna fall or anything? I feel like we're gonna fall in the through the. I feel floor. like they're going to fall like in a hole and just die. And I, just, I don't really remember much. What do you remember from this film? Um, I remember when Shaq comes out and he's like, I yes, am Kazam. And then isn't he like a rapper? Did he like turns into a, a rapper? It's a boom box, right? There's a boom box. Maybe. Something. I just remember like fast food or food falling from this kid. This kid should be dead. He should be murdered. That he would should be, be yeah. And, and they all kid, run. Yeah, they get just like, oh shit, he's dead. Oh, I gotta get out of here. I mean, this, this kid is dead as fuck. You know, it's funny. That scene reminds me of remember in the movie uh, The Frighteners when uh, Michael J. Fox falls through like three or four stories of that old mansion. Mm-hmm. That scene just kind of reminded me of that. To be honest with you, it's a good movie too. I like The Frighteners. Frighteners is good. It's a good movie. People... And Peter Jackson still gave a fuck. Yes. Yes. You ever see the outtakes for that movie? No, I haven't. No. Well, Michael J. Fox keeps calling out, like when he has to say a name or something. He goes, "Doc, Doc." <laughs> he was like so engraved into his mind that he kept <laughs> kept thinking he was on Back to the Future's. Yeah, see, now I want to see this now. Yeah, it's, it's pretty great. So it's a boombox. Yeah, 
So, yeah. so did the lamp go into the boombox? Like, how did that? That's what I thought. Thing? Wasn't something falling onto it or something? <sighs> I have been getting there. Mm. I think they should have just brought Shaq back as Genie in the new Aladdin movie. Why did they have to bring Will Smith in here? Well, Will Smith's got the, the. He knows where all the bodies are buried in Hollywood. You know. Uh, oh. Oof. Who? It's almost like he's. <laughs> Mm, man, that kid just goes right to murdering. I guess goes to murder a guy with a towel on his head. I mean, really, is he that threatening? He isn't. He isn't. Just... Oh, he's mm. got. Uh, okay, he's rapping already. This guy is good. I think I remember in this movie too. Doesn't the kid die or like his dad gets involved in some sort of like crime or criminal? Oh, does he? That's that's exciting. Dead. Yeah, there's some like weird shit that happens in this movie later on. I think that's what I remember. I'm just curious how this, how this, the first, the first uh, showing of this, uh, the big uh, premiere, of this movie. Yeah. You know, I it, wonder what, what do people think about this one? Yeah. Because when it came out, it became a joke. Yeah, it did. I mean, it holds I a 2.9. 2.9, huh? Wow. 2.9, which actually I think is lower than some of the films we've watched that no one's heard of. And people yeah. have heard of this movie. People have heard of Kazam. People, plenty, of, plenty of people have. Funny enough, two point nine is actually Shaquille O'Neal's free throw percentage. <laughs> no, it's not at all. Not even, not even that close. Not even that close. Not even that close. Yeah, I don't give. A f- well, I'll give you a wish. Gotta want something. Gotta want something, kid. I want you to be my dad. Could you be my new? Maybe Will you be my friend. new pop up? He meets the mom. Doesn't he meet the mom at one I point? Think, I think so. I think and he like meets acts, the whole family. Yeah. Acts like a like one of those like geeky. Uh, he's got the glasses on or something. Oh, maybe he's like a teacher or something like that. He's yeah. like, oh, this is my new teacher. Yeah. yeah how would Jeannie know what that is? I I, I don't know. It's. Uh, I mean, he's been locked up for thousands of years in yeah. that boombox. <laughs> in that boombox. He's been locked up for at least 15 years in that boombox. <laughs> oh, he doesn't have the power. Kids got to jerk him off to give him the power. <laughs> you got to rub a different kind of lamp. Hey, you when you're stuck in that for a while, I mean, it's yeah. possible. <laughs> he's got a lot of pent up problem. Oh, there he goes. He doesn't seem like a good, like, he doesn't seem like a very good genie. He just blew himself up. Yeah. He, he literally killed him. these notice, notice are still the, hanging around. Notice, notice the minorities in this movie are the bad guys. Yeah, of course. There's still like white guy in this game. Yeah. <laughs> you know? I won't give this movie credit. There is there is some good diversity in this movie. So a white kid getting beat up by, uh, you know. Is he white? Mexican. Yeah. He, yeah, looks like, white. he looks a little aborigine ish. You think? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we'll invite him to the next podcast. We'll do I, it. Well, we'll we got to find this kid first. What's his name? Tuchins. His name's Tuchins. Tuchins? Tuchins Jeffrey. Toy Tuchins. Tuchins Jeffrey. Poor kid's got no chin. He's got, he's got two chins. And what happened? Chin. Were you with the black guy again? I don't. What, you, were you hanging out in the wrong neighborhood again? As a firefighter. That's well, this guy of. looks like fucking Steve Gutenberg. <laughs> you know, he kind of reminded me of somebody else. I was trying to think of the name. But I go with Steve Guten. He's a, he's a little goot. He's a little goodish. A little goodish. Yeah, I told you. Remember, remember my story. I pissed with goot. You did. He stood right next to him. He stood right tall next to the goot. I stood down next to the goot. Yeah, you were like uh, police academy four. Good he flick. The actor. You know, the money even to actually be him. Hmm. No, nah, I don't think it is. He became a yeah. Scientologist and then got out of it and uh, did a few movies. You know, they say about people that leave Scientology. Yeah. They are not in Scientology anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> you know, how many Scientology buildings do you have in LA or Cal- Southern Cal? Wasn't the, there's a I couple. Have, there's one. one. We have one, one in Nashville. The big one um, is in what, LA, right? You got the big one right there in Los Angeles. Mm-hmm. And then um, one closer to me actually out here in the, in the Valley. Um, um, 
a high, actually I was watching a documentary going, uh, going clear. Oh, okay. Yeah. Talk so about it. Bits and pieces of that. It's like, uh, you know, no internet's going there and there's no, you know, it's, it's out there in the woods where no one can get to. And that's where I guess people go to disappear or whatever they were saying. Never to be heard from again. Well, you know, when I first moved out here, I went to Los Angeles. They did, uh, I did get uh, approached by a few, uh, a few of them and they brought out the, uh, the meter all the, all the auditing kit and everything uh-huh yeah i was just i laughed my ass off i thought it was the funniest thing ever did they think it was funny when no were, I don't, no they were like it's like this is to be taken quite serious this is some serious yeah. shit right here man get ready for some serious shit, shit. you ever have the uh, stars on your uh, ceiling uh no but um thinking the coals old nicole's sister's old room she used to have a bunch of those uh glow in the dark ones the glow in the dark stars yeah. on, on the on the top of the uh of the ceiling so pretty cool yeah, shit. no no I, I always had a ceiling fan above me because you know i like to you know stay cool and you know i like to freeze sleep yeah sleep in cold the greatest thing ever yeah i, was like, I don't want to sleep in deep space you know but what do you got here in the fridge you got anything good you got, you got some pepsi cola no, that's again, some milk. That's, that the second or third sunny time we saw that you got a little sunny d there that's some sunny fucking D right he there. He went for some sunny fucking D right there. Good, good job, but you go for the purple stuff. Nope, Bob had all that already. Oh uh, no, divorce. divorce! Oh boy. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh, that's how he figures it. Honey, I gotta go star in Universal Soldier. Don't have time for this fucking kinless fuck of a kid that we have. Keeps drinking all the sunny D. Nicholas Mateo. Hey Mateo. Oh. These are the movies I wish like you had like a Turtles like uh, cameo or something. You know, back in the yeah. day they did like the Marvel like uh, cameo here and there. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah, missed opportunity. Oh, what the? Oh, that's that's, that's that very was, normal to have a yeah six a foot fucking seven, seven foot, black uh, man following you in, in a white robe or a kind of dirty shabby robe. To be that honest. fits right in with New York. Now, okay, you you brought up earlier like the reception yeah, that this movie like took when it came out in the theater and everything like that. Yeah. Uh, like, what? How do you think it went down? Like on the it's, premiere uh, night. Well, I mean, it's pretty dull. I mean, we've we're nineteen minutes in. Yeah. Um, I mean, I give them I give them credit. They brought the genie out pretty quick. I think. Yeah. Um, I think so they they, they pop that, that uh, genie cherry real quick. Yeah. Yeah. If it was nowadays, it'd be like the last eighteen minutes of the movie where the genie comes out. Yeah. But uh, pretty lukewarm. Ex- I would say lukewarm. Yeah, I would yeah. say pretty lukewarm. You I think, think everyone like it's football good. Football? It's good. You think about it kid. like the entire like Los Angeles like, team now? Like, do you think Kobe went to the premiere? Nah, Kobe didn't go to the premiere. No, you don't think so? Nah, Kobe had better things to do? They hated each other at the time, right? Yeah. They hate each other? I don't think they hated each other at that moment in time, but, you know. Yeah, I'm sure Kobe probably got his own copy sent to him. Oh, so, I'm sure. I ain't going to the premiere. <laughs> come on, Shaq. Come on. Come come on, on Shaq. You want to get into that? Who do you think you're going to be? Come on, Shaq. You gotta, oh, own okay. a, you gotta own a fucking Papa John's one day, okay? One day you're gonna be, you are going to be the Papa John. It's not the acting; it's the pizza you gotta look yeah. forward to. Or you know, what's the other thing he hawks? The t- tough acting, tin acting. Does he sell that? Or the icy other, hot, the icy, icy hot, icy yeah, hot. The icy hot yeah. guy. Yeah. He's got a couple. I think he does like the general or some insurance. And yeah, like, general insurance and. But you know, hot. Papa John, Papa John, Papa John, Papa John, Papa John, Papa John, Papa John. You threw the N word around a few times, and uh, so now they're like, "What are we gonna do next? Let's get a black man. Let's get a yeah. seven foot fucking black man." Yeah. And hey, I mean, Shaq wasn't busy at the time, I guess. So it's like, "Hey, Shaq, can you handle the weight? Can you can you wear the Papa John crown for you're us, a Genie Man? You are. Right? We remember your What's fine his name work. This movie? What is the Genie's name? Is is it Genie? Or is it actually Kazam? I think his name is Kazam. He, yeah, he's, Kazam. At, at one point, he goes like, "I am Kazam." And okay, so it fits in with our theme for uh, yeah, or uh, screaming. Somebody's screaming a name. Yeah, you know? yeah. With, with the Z's and the uh, he's yelling yeah. this. The letters mm-hmm. creates a word. Oh, is this guy? Oh, I thought this guy's this from cocaine. I was gonna say, is it a drug dealer? Like he, he looked like he was going in for the cocaine sniff. I thought it was Gabriel. Uh, what's his name? Gabriel Byrne. Burn, yeah. 
Whoa, oh, we got a kid. Oh, uh, we got a kid here. Kill him. Who are you? I'm two kids. <laughs> you know, the 90s with all the concrete walls. You know, yeah, the, 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 concrete. the extremely like industrial look to it. Yeah. Oh, Masaha, Masahama Laika, my brother. So, Does anyone say, like, hey, you look like Shaq? Yeah, that seems like a missed opportunity. <laughs> missed opportunity? Yeah. It's like, hey, are you, are you a it's basketball a weird shot. Player? This is a weird shot right here. Yeah, he's like, yeah, it's like looking at his belt. Looking right at his ball sack. Yeah. That's what they call me, the Shaq Diesel. Now, okay, here's another question for you. In picking this film. Yeah, let him have him. Throw him at me. What was your thought process behind picking this movie for me as opposed to picking it for DJ? Well, time of, time. of recording. <laughs> it's all about the time. <laughs> you know, um, it, if it was the other way around, most likely it would have been the exact same thing. Um, uh, but, um, you know, I don't know. I think it it's kind of It's really fit. more of convenience. There's no rhyme or reason behind picking this. No. No, yeah, you know, I, I, thought, I, thought, I thought, you know, it's coming out in April. Um, yeah. And then I saw that 12 pack DVD and I was like, I think I think this would be a good movie to watch. I'm and interested about in another 11 that. movies were in the 12 pack. Yeah, it was. Well, um, <laughs> I'll uh, save those for later. It's Pat, I think it's Pat was the other one. Uh, uh-huh. There was a couple other ones that were in there. Um, um, Oh, now was this like was this like a, a widely released pack or is this like some type of like fan pack made or something? Like no, that? no, it was it was it was on Amazon. I bought it on Amazon. Um, one of those one of those things I do is when I buy shit on Amazon, I always like buy like a, a shitty thing, a shitty DVD or, or shitty pack of DVDs, and this yeah. was like a twelve pack for like eight bucks or something. It was I was like, all right, I'm yeah. buying, it, throwing it in there. But there was a couple movies I haven't seen in a very long time. Some I never heard. Um, um Celtics was another one with um um uh what's oh god I can't think of the names. Um when they <laughs> kidnapped a guy, you know, to that the I mean it's basketball related, but there it's Pat was the other one. And okay. uh basketball shitty. related kidnapping? Yeah, it's uh Celtics. Oh Celtic, Celtic Pride Celtic. with uh, Dan Aykroyd Celtic and Pride, yeah, Dan Aykroyd and uh, Damon Wayans. Yep. I used to watch that old. That, that, that used to be on Encore and Stars a lot. Oh, was it? Yeah, a lot. I don't think I've. Liter- I literally don't believe I've ever watched it. I've only seen the poster a few times. It's it's not it's not bad. It's I'm actually not a big basketball guys. So you know, never uh, hear. Really David, David Wayne's is pretty funny in that in that movie. He's okay. You know, I'll, I'll check it out. Give it a shot. I mean, it's 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 no worse than uh than this movie right here. Kazan. Yeah. Now, okay, so I mean, if the kid if the kid has three wishes, what would you wish for? I think it'd be very easy. Like, if this is me, what, what year is this? Ninety ninety five? I want to say ninety four, ninety five, ninety six, ninety six. Wow, yeah, this is ninety. It's actually a little later than I thought. I thought yeah, it was actually I thought it was earlier. like ninety four, ninety five. Yeah, IMDb says ninety six, July of ninety six. Oh, so this was a um, big summer flick in ninety six. Yeah, well, wow, really, really made its mark. It did. Uh, but it's if, Hey, it's, we're reviving this, you know. A lot of people are going to be listening to this commentary for because there, there, has there been a commentary for uh, Kazam yet? I highly doubt this is a first. Well, and look at these. Look at look at this effect. Look at these effects. These look. are impressive. Only the best for Touchstone Pictures and Disney Studios here. I mean, if you're not going to bring the effect, probably don't do a movie that's heavily. Yeah, heavily. Yeah, a lot of effects yeah. going on. Yeah, leaning up against the effects here. Yeah, the genie. I mean, they could have they could have stayed a little low key with the effects. I think. You yeah, know, smoke machine and all. I mean, they could have get. Yeah, they could have definitely gone low fi I mean, you're you're spending this much money on Shaq, you know, because you got to cut corners a little bit. But if a genie's going to ask you as a kid, you've got three fucking wishes. Yeah, I mean. I mean, it has to be so, material, uh, right? It has to be material. So, oh, here's the food. Yeah, that's the food. Oh, big at oh, Jesus Christ. I think there is more. Imagine, have you ever had somebody throw a hamburger at you? Never did, no. I think no. you have to pay for that out here on the West Coast. Oh, yeah? How about a bean yeah. burrito? 
Well, that can be free in certain areas. Uh, you just got to know how to speak the language. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Well, yeah. next time I'm out there. Next time I'm out there, hopefully you can uh, show me the way. But I'd probably be like, you know, Super Nintendo? Yeah, right? Genesis? I mean, mm-hmm. Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis. 64 isn't out yet. Watch Kazam, I couldn't picture this. I mean, there's a lot of things I can think of at the time as a kid like that. He, this kid wanted, um, so he, first of all, now all this food's, okay, all the candy's, you know, is packaged. So, but like, are you eating a fucking bean burrito that gets opened up on the floor? I'm not eating that. He's a shitty genie. I mean, we've established that already. Yeah, he's not very good. It took him this like, long to actually. I guess you got to specify, like, I like a bean burrito on yeah. a plate in my hand. Yeah, and I don't consider like a bean burrito like junk food. I feel like that's like a meal. Like I'm gonna eat a bean burrito. It's a fantastic meal. It's fantastic. Yeah. It's fantastic. Same thing with like you know a stack of like flapjacks. Nobody's eating a fucking stack of flapjacks. Well, by the way, this candy <laughs> falling from the sky. I mean, that's it's gonna hurt if it hits you in the fucking. Oh, it would hurt. Imagine yeah. you get hit in the fucking head with like a goddamn Milky Way. Is that pancakes to the side it's there on the right? Pancakes fucking with soda uh, over there. Yeah, Pepsi. see the kid gets got fucking knocked on the head with a goddamn. It's abuse. Candy bar. It's abuse. The kid's yeah. the kid is PTSD. The kid is yeah, this guy has. Oh, I bet you. Oh, you didn't answer me. Okay, so what? What else? What else would you probably wish for? I don't know, like a go kart, maybe at this at this age. At this go-kart. point in time, yeah, yeah, probably a go kart, some video game shit related. Uh, mm-hmm. I don't know, comic uh, book related, uh, yeah, like all the comic books in the entire world type. I want of all thing. the comic books. I want I want every Batman comic. I want every comic book com- in like mint condition. It has to be material, right? So it has to be a, a physical, like, right? Physical, yeah, not yeah. There's no digital at this point, right? So it would have to be like uh, I don't know. Give me a blank fucking check, motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Give me a, a, a winning lottery ticket. Let me star in blank check. That's my wish. I want to be in blank check. I think I can do better than that other fucking kid. Movie's fucking fantastic, right? This is this is the funny era of films where you had a lot of these weird movies with kids like having like a lot of money or getting a lot of power and stuff like a lot of power. Like yeah, I fucking it's like told, giving the kids all fucking, this power. That fucking tooth just went right into that fucking it, candy it, bar. It, yeah, it, yeah, exactly. It was very... You think Shaq still has that outfit? I think he still wears that? I think he has to. Like, I mean, when you're Shaq, you don't, you don't get rid of your stuff when you're Shaq. How'd that happen? I don't know. You're with the fucking genie, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> Anything's fucking possible. <laughs> How'd that happen? How'd that happen? And any, no, no one's questioning this uh, keeping no. with this uh, not with this giant African American fellow. Not that there's anything wrong with that. No, not at all. Not not at all. Uh, that's no, no. What ice cream in the like, pocket? Bubble gum? Melted bubble gum? I don't know. It looked like jizz. Is that bubble gum? Look, next you? time you drop a load in my pocket, let me know first. Mr. Muhammad Ali. <sighs> you ever trip? You ever trip with the the the, the, sh- the shoelace tied? It's pretty. No, it's I, I never, I never got touched by that. I'm, the only thing that ever happened to me. I've is had that, it happen to me, but I've never had, tripped you, and fell. I'm oh. like, oh, look at that! It's they're tied together. Oh, you saw it it's like, oh, huh? No, ah, I, felt, guys. I felt it. I felt my hand, my one foot going ahead, the other, and then I felt a little stop. Ah, yeah, yeah, I see a tidy, you jokers, you motherfucker, you, you motherfucker, you. Can you get Ever? hit by a car? <laughs> it's like, I wish I got hit by a car. Look at this guy. Come on, Shaq. Shaq's he ready. His, he was ahead of his time. He was ahead of his time. It's In like fashion. He, he's one of those little rappers now. Little, little Shaq. Little, little Kazan. Shaq. <laughs> Did you ever do the thing in school, like when you had somebody like stand, but not stand, but like lean, like get on all fours behind somebody, you pushed them over, and they like went over? You ever do that? Well, you supposed to catch them or something? No, about? no, it's like you have like a, a friend, like a friend or somebody you know, like like. Oh, I didn't have friends. Oh, you didn't have friends? Okay, I have, I have bitches. So maybe maybe this happened. Oh, you have bitches. Uh, bitch. Maybe it's one of your bitches. Like you know, you have one of your bitches. And she got on all fours behind the person you were talking. It's like, hey, uh, so and so, what's going on? And then you push them, and then they fall over the other person, like over their back. And then you go, like, 
You ever do that? No, I know what you're talking about now. Yeah. I definitely know what you're talking about, but never You've probably did because I was never somebody. a dick. No. Oh. But you had bitches. Whoa, this guy is serious. He's serious. He's from Europe. <laughs> Europe. You like having cigarettes put out on your neck? Because I do. Where are they at? Where is this the same building you were just at? They're back in the weird studio that the, the guy was about to do blow in. What is this? What is this area? Oh, it's the Brad. You know who the Brad is, right? I'm, I'm, I, uh, yes, I, I know. I, I, I know of. Of the Brat? Of the Brat. She's still alive these days? Or the dead? Brat? I think the Brat's still kicking it. She's probably a mother. Mother of six. Working at the local library, fuck. teaching uh, um, 80-year-old people to get on Facebook. Oh, yeah. I hope one day I can attain to that. I think that's a pretty strong career move. At it's the same point. guy, right? Yeah, it's the same guy. You don't guy. remember the kid that happened? Was it the same day? Wasn't it the same fucking day or something? Or I don't know. Maybe, maybe he unwished that he never met this guy. This becomes a new father or something? I, I think so. Or maybe it's a twist that it is his father, but he... Uh-oh. He's having a realization. Wait. Look at your fucking teeth. Are you me? <laughs> am, I, am I staring into a mirror? Oh, man. <laughs> Everybody shut the fuck up. This it's my, my kid. Boy. I Everybody's mean, so the tooth's, excited. The tooth's not me, but uh, no, the, the, the other, other shit. Recognize that tooth anyway. The guy just waved him. Yeah, he's like, "Hey, what's up, brat?" I love how how she want to fuck him or something. What was that? I, like? I, I don't know. There, there was know. a no, she gave she gave him the old fuck me eyes. That was a fuck me lie. Yeah, that was a fuck me eye. Like, that was I'd like, I'd fuck him. Like, um, how 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 easily accepted this kid now is he? Oh, you're my son. Yeah, uh, it's like damn. I would never get to, if I had a kid just walking to my house one day and go like, "Hey, you're my dad." I'm like, let me, no, see I'm not. let me see the paperwork. Yeah, let me see the papers. Hey, it's Papa John. It's the real Papa John's here. Yeah. It's future. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a future. Now, why does the why does Sam want him to get the wishes done so quick? Does he want to go back into the boombox? Probably. You ever you ever walk uh, New York City in the nineties? Is this New York City or L.A.? Is this uh, Southern? Is this California? Is that- I don't know what city this is. It's kind of like no. I don't know. That's don't good. Know that's a good question, actually. Now, you, now you're making me. This is kind of maybe filming like locations: Brooklyn, New York. Yeah, New York. New York. Okay. You know, filming locations: Brooklyn, New York, Los Angeles. California. Oh, so oh. I don't know. Hmm. This is uh, technically established as. Yes. Where is? Is the actual place of this movie taking place? I don't know if it's really a big deal, but yeah, yeah. Well, that kid's that kid's fucking tooth needs to be fixed. That kid, he needs an orthodontist stat. Stat, get this kid an orthodontist. Get this kid an haircut. Well. Stat, That's haircut. Well. And tell him to stop wearing vests. Tell yeah, him got, this kid's uh, got a weird fetish. Tell him to stop talking to, back to his mom. He's got, he's got that. She med- just med- toss him into like the corner. Apparently, yeah. Oh God! Like, oh, I just goodness. met. I just met my real dad. You found him. You found, you found him. him, didn't you? You found that fuck. You told me he was wearing a condom. <laughs> I said, "Come, come inside me." <laughs> he cream pies. One, one day I'm gonna have a <laughs> the old like POV a, cream pie, like a fucking Krispy Kreme donut. <laughs> then he left me like all men do at the, ironically enough at the Krispy Kreme at the Krispy Kreme donuts <laughs> that's why I like women I will never go back to the dick anymore never. the dick is dead dick is dangerous be it causes careful the dick. look what it did to your tooth look, look at it it caused you to happen it caused a deformity it's a dick tooth or well, established in september if he's uh turning back his calendars correctly but uh it looks like we're september maybe in new york oh okay september in new york huh there's a black man on a ceiling <laughs> made out of stars made out of, 
And he ate like a baseball, I feel, just now. He did. He's a bunch of genie. Anything's possible. Yeah, anything's possible when you're a genie. Yeah. Oh, now he's moving. Now he's slithering. He's oozing down the wall. It felt a little itish. Yeah. That was a little Georgie. Nice. Hello, Georgie. Like, yeah. Beep, beep, Ricky. Beep, beep. Where's this kid at, you think, nowadays? You think he's uh, some drug addict somewhere? Uh, he's one of these child actors who did a movie, maybe two, and just kind of disappeared into obscurity. I don't know. All right. Well, I think... Uh, there was a glut of child actors in the movie. I think midnight. I found them. Really? Yeah, I think I found them. He was huh. in A Bronx Tale. A Bronx Tale, huh? He was in A Bronx Tale. Oh. Say it ain't so, Joe. Say it ain't so. Say it ain't so, toothless. But uh, he's all tatted up these days. Oh, yeah. He's looking like a rough, like a rough kid. Yeah, a rough young man. Uh, I, think, I think you're right. I don't think he's uh, Caucasian. No, I think no. I think he's, he's definitely something else. He's not. Mm-hmm. He, he ain't white. Definitely Italian. He's definitely a paisan. He's a paisan. Look at that. Paisan. He's got the tattoos on the face. He's got, guy. He's got shaved head these days. He's got the goatee and the tattoos. And I don't know about the fucked up tooth, but I'm, I'm, I'm hoping it's it's. But did he get his teeth fixed? Is the important oh, question. He's on smile. I can't see. No, oh, I'm fine. Let's see him. He was a free really uh, free really too. The adventure home. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I guess he, he took over for uh, Jason Mark Richter, whatever his name was, uh, the other kid in Free Willy. Who knows? Oh, you know what I do? Yeah, that, that kid was free. He was the troublemaker. He was like, yeah, hey, fuck Free Willy. And then Free Willy ate him. Because it's the tooth, right? Yeah, the tooth, yeah. He's like, trying to take my tooth. He's trying to steal my whale tooth. Buddy. Dad's like a record producer. My dad could put you in the records. Oh man, this kid is trying him now. So is it? So is this kid trying to make his wish come true now? Oh man, it's a role reversal in this. Uh... <laughs> Kazam! Kazam! He's got the boombox and all. It, everything. Do you think this was something the director wanted or something uh, Shaquille wanted? Hey, I, mean, I don't thing. know. I think what, she, what Shaquille wants, Shaquille gets. And that's the problem right then and there. What the fuck? Oh, oh I love gold. Man, she is getting hard over this gold. I shoved it up my ass. <laughs> you ever had a gold suppository? Oh. She is, man, she's getting wet for the gold. She is it's a fucking ocean. I want free Willie too. Oh, the old, the old switcheroo. The old switcheroo. The old, the old shackaroo. The old shackaroo. So who who are these rapping chicks? Oh, it's like a like a fake TLC maybe. I about to say like a fake salt and pepper or something like salt that. Salt and pepper. Yeah, maybe. There's two of them or is three of them? Well, in Salt and Pepper, there was three. It was Salt, Pepper, and Spinderella. Oh, I didn't know there was a third one. Yeah, she was the DJ. Oh, okay. Well, she was know. on the wheels of steel. A white guy from New Jersey. These things. Uh, oh, oh like I get it. So party. this guy is kind of Arab, so he's definitely into genies. I get it. Was there a mozzarella in the involved or anything? I don't know. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't, I didn't take a grated look. Grated cheese, it. salt, grated, pepper, grated cheese, <laughs> salt and pepper, garlic butter. Oh, Mrs. Yeah, Dash. Oh, getting that white wipe down. Little, little old, bay, old Bay season salt. Hey, Kazam, he's been locked up for thousands of years. He needs to yeah. pop a load. Man, can you imagine? Like, it's like I need to have I need to hit a few free throws. Hey, this is my son and it's fucked up. Too. Hey, look at my son. Get the fuck out of here. It's like, Dad, we just met. Hey, that doesn't seem safe. No. Way that electricity. Like an electric fence, yeah. Whoa. Is that a murderer man right now? <laughs> he might. It's like, I'm going to have to murder this guy in front of you. Now you're part of the family business. That's right. Let's kill a man together, son. <laughs> your first kill. <laughs> you always remember your first kill. Uh, this, kid's, okay. uh, this, this kid's not going to have a good life. That's right, probably why he turned into the kid. Yeah. 
He's got fucking goons. Joey two times here. Fuck Joey two. Joey Goomba. Joey Goomba knows. That was a quick uh, everyone coming in there. Yeah, right? See this guy. He's, change out. Yeah, this guy's into genies, I feel. He's I a genie. a black man with a gold. Gold tooth. Gold uh, jewel. Gold jewel. I love gold jewels. I love gold jewels. And I love tall black men. I have a wish. I wish for a tall black man. Well, don't we all? I mean, really, when it comes down to it. Yeah. When you really think about it. Gotta find a, gotta find a tall black man. Oh. What a good man you are. Mm, ah, yes. Ah, yeah. Mm. Man. Well, so what's that? Well, so what have we missed in this movie so far? Well, in, this movie in, just took a turn. Over, over 40 minutes in, and I'm not quite sure. 40 minutes of a kid who gets picked on. Yeah. Finds his a whole, genie. His whole genie life. wants to make three wishes. Yeah. He refuses to make three wishes. All of a sudden, the movie now turns. Into like, I'm going to organize crime. Yeah. They want the genie. Because uh, the genie, for some reason, shot out some fucking shot diamonds. Some, gold yeah, diamonds. Some diamonds. Yeah. Is. yeah. This is what we call lazy writing 101. Yeah. We know it's funny. There is a lot of writing going. There's a lot of talking back and forth. There's a lot of dialogue. You know, there's a lot of stuff going on. But I don't think we're really, you know, appreciating it right now. There's a lot of it's like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, He is. Yeah, that's who he is. This girl is just actuated. She loves the Shaq Diesel. She wants to shack up with the shack. She, well, she's shacking up with Shaq. She wants some shack foo. Mm. Maybe, maybe it's a twist. Maybe she's a genie as well. Well, that'd be a oh man, the what wife of the genie. Yes, imagine she's she had this connection because she was let out earlier. Yep, mm-hmm. yeah. out of a fucking dirt devil. <laughs> Fucking Hoover. Dude, you're so great. Like, he's saying it's not that great, and everyone loves it. Again, we're going back to the uh, the premiere, premiere yeah. night. Yeah. And everyone's just like, Sha- it was good. Good movie, Shaq. Good Shaq. I mean, I can't believe. Good. I, well, look at this. The food. Oh, man. Oh, don't blow your cup. Yet there, three thousand days. It's still a lot of time to not have goat eyeballs. Yeah, three thousand days. Is that guy, goat eyeballs. It's quite a bit. Goat yeah. eyeballs. And who just has goat eyeballs in their um, limo? No, they come and with the car. This guy's going, and this guy's going to work on the goat eyeball. Yeah, you know, you should cut back Ooh. on the, the goat eyes. Yeah, a lot of, mm-hmm. a lot of carbs. High, yeah, high cholesterol too. Very high cholesterol. Yeah, but they're gluten free, so you know it'll be okay. Silly, well, won't be the problem is really head. when you shit them out. Somebody's watching you shit. Oh man, yeah, I hate that. Always got your eye on your asshole. Always judgmental look too on the eyes. Yeah, they're always kind of like I don't know. One time it happened to me, one winked at me. I was like, "How yeah, we get it?" Which is weird because they have no eyelids whatsoever. No eyelids, no nothing. Don't yeah. But that shit it, it was weird. Them. Yep, wink, Martindale. So got some uh, Javons here. And, uh, okay, so these guys, these hooligans are. Uh, so dad's a part of uh, organized crime. Yeah, it seems like he is. Yeah, uh, this almost seems like a uh, like a Mr. Nanny like knockoff movie a little bit. Mr. Nanny and uh, or uh, Santa with muscles maybe. Oh yeah. Or uh, uh, what's the other one with the uh, barbarian boys, the barbarian twins, the uh, the twins, the, the twin sitters. Yeah. yeah, twin sitters, or um, that what's twin the sitters? other one with the fat, with the fat boys, disorderlies maybe. There's a quite a collection of those, huh? Yeah, there was a lot of movies in the '80s where it was, or even the early '90s with Hulk Hogan, you know, Sam with muscles, Mister Nanny. That's all I know. Thunder in Paradise. Hey, I know. It's- don't you knock that down. Don't you fucking speak ill of th- Thunder in Paradise. What's the other one where he's uh, an alien? Oh, Bionic Commando. Bionic Commando, yeah. I knew it was yeah. Commando sometimes. That was, a, what, that was Christopher Lloyd. Lloyd. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
That was the start of the uh, Hulkster's uh, film career right there. Right. Well, there was two other wrestlers in there, right? The the other guys that came looking for him or something. Yeah, Maybe I'm not sure who was in it. As well. Yeah. Who, who else was in that? No. I, I just remember Christopher Lloyd and uh, Hawk. Yep. So you really need to know. So yeah. Right, so, so what's Dad into here? So he's Dad's into, into music, but he's also into some other weird shit going on. But I don't know how he got there. Really? Yeah. Uh, we are talking over it, so maybe we yeah, missed I, one there, more. There, yeah, I'm sure there's a lot more going on in this movie than we're letting letting in. Poor mom sitting by you herself. Know. Yeah. Well, that sandwich made her fucking sandwich and didn't eat it. It's a waste. There's starving kids in East LA that would love that sandwich. Again, we don't know where this is taking place. Yeah, no, I'm just I'm just projecting right now. You want to say New York, but yeah, I don't know. What's he wearing? What's the badge? Is that for school? Uh, he's got a lanyard, so he can he, he can go to the uh, show. He was at the uh, special show, so oh, he had his, okay. Uh, so like that like so Thinking like he's part of X Men or something here. Maybe I don't know. The fucked up tooth. Is that a special? It is <laughs> fucked up tooth. Charles, Charles, your tooth is fucked. I found the kid. <laughs> The fucked up tooth. <laughs> Fuck it. Tooth. It's, it's incredible. <laughs> the tooth. The it's tooth can so tell your future. Up. The tooth. The tooth can give you wishes. Why would I want that? You got Jubilee over here. Why do you got her? Yeah. <laughs> I have a yellow raincoat fetish. Uh, we needed an Asian. <laughs> we need a fucked up kid with the tooth. We needed this kid who looks slightly like an aborigine. Yeah, we don't know what he is. Don't know. I'm going to again. I'm just guessing. He's part. I'm going to go with the the Italian. The Italian, a little paisan. Yeah, he's paisan. Yeah, paisan. Captain America. There you go. Comic book. There's a little. There there's a little crossover for you. No DC stuff, huh? No, that DC crap. Oh my uh, god. That's like me Saturday morning right there. Just big giant man in my bed. How many times has a black man woke you up in bed? Uh, well, not enough yet. About uh, eight for me. <laughs> about eight times. About about eight. Oh, shit. Wow, he just threw that's, a very hard baseball at his you, head. You throw a baseball at a person that's a couple feet away. That's fucked up right in the head. Yeah. That's, Whoa. You know what? If Shaq Murray is this kid right now, I'm okay with it. Yeah, I would. I, 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 I would be throw okay. Him the, throw him off the fucking bridge. Yeah. He took it like a champ, though. I'll come on that. He did. He took it like a Shaq Diesel. Oof. Oh. It seems kind of racist. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, it's like, Shaq, you do whatever you want. It's like, can I wear this gorilla mask? Nah, Shaq, uh, come on, Shaq. man. You're better than that. I mean, you're better than that, Shaq. There's so many other masks you could wear. Yeah. <laughs> why a gorilla, man? Why, why, a gorilla? Why, have, why that gorilla mask? Oh, how about a monkey? Again, <laughs> like, so many. Yeah, so many different animals you could pick from. You, you could do a shark. Animal. You know, a shark would be great, a yeah. bear. Um, how about this gorilla mask, like Shaq? Uh, oh, God, oh Shaq! We got, we got, we got Captain America. We, we got to give Shaq. I mean, Spider-Man. Okay, so you ever have a giant? You snake? smell like a hippopotamus cock. He knows those, from that, those uh, eyeballs. That one time in uh, Lancashire. <laughs> wait, <sighs> wait, wait! I, I don't know what's happening right now. Yeah. Being has a he, guy, how does he know the songs? If he's yeah. been locked up for thousands of years, I don't know. I guess well, he wasn't a boombox, so maybe there was like some. Music. Okay, I'll um, give him that. But give also, that. when you're with like an eight year old, uh, probably don't want to be naked in his room. No. <laughs> you ever have a giant photos of snakes on your uh, your door? No, I never thought about it. Like a like a green python poster. Yeah. Did you ever have that book? And there was a book along. I just had naked. Um, it was like a National Geographic book. Yeah, well, it was kind of like that, but it was like naked animals. I started off yeah. as a as young as a child. Yeah, well, <clears throat> yeah, that explains a lot. Does it? I mean, I thought it did for a minute. Maybe I'm mistaken. No, no, just yeah. I, I thought I thought I knew you. That's advanced for my for my for my age. Yeah, <laughs> you you developed quickly, huh? Quite quickly. Cool. Now look at me. I'm drinking a bottle of wine, talking to you, watching. <laughs> That's how far we've come. <laughs> that one day I saw that naked girl. Mm, changed, changed my life. 
Oh, this is what I was thinking of. Oh yeah, when he's like, oh, I'm the guy, I'm his teacher. Oh. Do you yeah. And nowadays she just pull out a gun and shoot him dead. Yeah, exactly. It's like, look, he snuck into the house, obviously. And then the cops would be like, There's a dead black guy, let's shoot him again. Yeah. Make you gotta make sure. <laughs> God. Do you really Oh, she's yeah. really uh, what you, what's the word? Uh, she's really uh, taken okay with this. Yeah, she's okay with it too. She's fairly okay with this. Yeah, seven foot black man just appeared in her. I mean, I mean, what would you do if like Shaq walked into your house dressed like this? Well, you know, like I did last time, I essentially just invited him over. I gave him something to drink and told him yeah. to leave. Yeah, uh, they're gonna give him the old belt buckle treatment. Would you would you like that? Like to show me your your guy fucking me? Can you show me your <laughs> fucking belt buckle? I just got a hot dog. Right? Got you? a hot dog. I got a kosher dill. Does it come the new father? That's what that's that's how the movie should go. I think so. He's like you're my new you're my new genie father. This could have been a great movie if it was like really R rated. <sighs> oh you know? yeah. And the genie was fucking with the kid. Oh yeah. Like he ruined his entire life like horribly. Yeah. Like a really dark version. Like, of, I fucked your mom scene. last night. Fucking you make like, those that wishes was, yet? Like, that was my wish. wish. Yeah. I'm just going to take your wishes, and your wishes are going to be my wishes. Whoa. Oh, it's right up the end. I ass. thought going to go up the old, the old, the old poop. <laughs> I mean, that's where we're at here. That's supposed to be yeah. rethinking that Shaq's I mean, trying to show. wanted an R-rated version of this movie, and we almost got it. Toast into a woman's asshole. Yep. <laughs> It's like I've I've seen that video before. We we've had viewing parties actually on that video. Yeah, we have. That can't be healthy. No, stuffing a whole piece of toast in your mouth. I mean, he could choke. I, yeah, I feel like this kid should be dead. Another outfit change, man. Look at these outfits. Yeah, but the kid needs to get some fucking yeah. needs new clothes. I mean, hey, I give a shot. At least he's changing. Oh yeah, I mean. But he looks like a, uh, you know what? I'm not going to say it. I'll get emails on it. Oh, well, I'll say it anyway. I want to, I want to read the emails. <laughs> like, let's, 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 like, let's, let's, not, we're already, we're already, we're already far into this. We're, right, this emails, is, aren't, e- emails aren't going to bother us. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nothing yeah. can keep us down. Nothing can keep us down. No. Nothing can keep those collars down either. No, not at all. I don't care how much starch you're putting into that. Not oh. enough starch in the world. Not enough starch. <laughs> did he do? Uh, did he do steel after this or before this? This steel was after this because I think this hit really big. Did it really? Obviously. Yeah, it, hit ma- it was massive. I can, huge, I can see it. So much does not happen in this movie. Or, I don't know. Maybe steel. Maybe steel was like ninety-five. I don't know because I feel like what was or the only thing that was really coming out? I think Batman. Forever probably came out. Then they're like, hey, we need another superhero. How about Steel? Let's throw him out there. I think, sure. Yeah, sounds right. Yeah, I don't know. It could be because he's talking, talking my fucking ass. But you know. See that Kazan movie? It's fucking fantastic. It's fucking fantastic. There's it's a the best genie, movie you've ever seen. And he's a rapper. He plays basketball. It's good. Gets a genie. Has three wishes. Doesn't make them. It's fantastic. But it's half the fucking movie completed to some kid about making wishes. And breaks out singing a few oh, times. There you go. It's like a musical now. I think it was in his contract. I have to he, sing he four he's times. The Summer of Sam? Yeah, he is the Summer of Sam. <laughs> this, this scene reminds me of The Pest with John Lopezamo for some reason. Now, that's a, that's a movie right there. Whoa! Oh man! Oh, another outfit change. Did you see his voice change? Like I saw that? His, his voice dropped. Like he, yeah. he became a man. He, he must have had a nice reach around from Jack. Oh! Don't do 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 do. It's very uncomfortable. Is this very uncomfortable to watch? I feel I'm very uncomfortable as kid. <sighs> yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm fine with Shaq. He finds a sandpit like that. 
I don't know. I don't know. I mean, this I mean, I guess buried. I guess. I guess he is a genie. So okay, so I'm trying to figure out this song, like the purpose of it here. We ain't men, we genie. Kid's so cool. I want to be like kid when I grow up with a yeah. fucked up tooth. I wish I could just go back in time and just be this kid. Do you? Yeah, why not? This has got to be New York. Look at it's, that. Yeah, that's, that's very New York y. That's, that's Brooklyn right there. That's New York for you. That's a sh- new, shitty New York, shitty 90s New York. Yeah. We can get a blowjob and heroin in the same location. Yeah. And you have to wish Now you have to travel. Yeah. You don't need a genie to get a blowjob in New York in the 90s. No, you didn't. <laughs> you buy one, get one, usually. Yeah, usually. Mm. Not that I know. A little BOGO action always yeah. helps. Buy one, get one. <laughs> Down at the bo- bodega. You got to go to the local bodega, get a BOGO at the bodega. That kid's hair looks fucking dirty. You watch that shit. <sighs> I, this kid does not shower. I mean, seriously, he doesn't change his fucking clothes. The same fucking yeah. clothes. Same fucking vest. Yeah, same fucking galaxy on his fucking shirt. You ever, you ever, you ever wear a fucking shirt with a galaxy on it? No. No, No, nah, because this kid fucking hogged them all. He, he took them all. He bought, <laughs> he wished for them all to be his. He went into fucking Kmart and was like, I'm buying all your fucking galaxy shirts. I'll buy all your fucking galaxy shirts, you fucking cow. Don't tell me I can't because I know a fucking genie. Yeah. <laughs> I know a seven foot genie. Do you know a seven foot genie? No? Well, fuck you. Doesn't believe in fairy tales. You're a fucking fairies. genie. What did the genie like want to not hang out with a kid? I yeah, you would think like Shaq would say, "Look, I you like I you thousands of stuff. years, and now I'm out here in New York in the '90s. Shit, this, I am gonna find." I mean, it was in a limo eating fucking some, yeah. eyeballs with that other chick. I want to know the age-old question: if if, if 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 a little person has the same cock and ball ratio as a yeah. normal person, and quite frankly, they do. Yeah, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Person, everything shrinks on them except for their balls and their, yep. their dick. It's funny how that works. It's incredible. Life, life finds a way. Life, uh, life, life laughs a lot, doesn't it? No, yeah. sometimes he's got a life laugh right back at it. So, yo, you want to become a man? You ever suck a man's dick before? <laughs> it's probably, probably shouldn't do this on the on the fucking stair yeah. staircase here. <laughs> Or you move to the side, you know, allow the people. Yeah, he gets to, move to over. By. Yeah, you know this kid makes he's he's serious these days. Kids. He's got a fucked up eyebrow. Yeah. You see this line? Line in my this, left this eyebrow. Right here? See this right that here? Means, it means I'm ready. That means I killed your dad. I killed. You, I fuck your dad. <laughs> this means, this this line's for fucking your dad. And then I this killed. One's, this this one's for fucking your dad twice while you watch. And the third line. The third line is. I do your taxes and I rape you. <laughs> you know, with the charges. Like the, just like, just like the real IRS. <laughs> I'm this, is called, this is called the Turbo Tax uh, line. Turbo Tax. <laughs> what do turbo you think tax you're going to be internet someday? You could do that shit online. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. I'll do your fucking taxes. What, you but got I'm a genie or something? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Well, this guy's being roughed up, huh? Who's it be? Oh, by him? I don't believe he's... Oh, by the, genie, by, by the genie guy. Mr. By the genie fake boy. Italian? Yeah. yeah I don't by know a, by a Babu Bats from Seinfeld. Babu Bats, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've referenced so many people probably won't get. No, not at all. <laughs> it's like, that's racist. Like, no, it's an actual character from a Seinfeld. I'm going to make this up. Bad man. Very bad man. My, they said my lawyer friend. My lawyer friend, a Jew, by the way. A Jew? Have you seen the Jews? <laughs> got the greatest. Oi, Faye, he took your seat. <laughs> we can't have that here. Your pawn shop, little boy? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. You're telling me little boys robbed you? <laughs> <laughs> this, this eight year old kid robbed the shit out of me. I mean, I think you're the one with fucking problems. Yeah. (laughs) Seems like you need some help. Look, Shazam or Kazam or whoever is just trying to get his fuck on right now. He is trying to get his... I don't blame him. 
No, why don't they say she's she's a she's a nice she's looking cutie. girl. She's cutie. Yeah. She's cute. She's cutie. Yeah. Fucking eyebrows need to be worked on, but I think she's a fucking well, cutie. I mean, that's the style. Yeah. A little rough, a little rough right there. Like oh, is it the, they look pretty well plucked and I, know, I, I think they're uh, just like drawn she, on correctly. No, I think the strip right down the middle there. I think she needed to uh, curve it out a little bit. I think. Uh, I think. It's, yeah, it's a little, a little harsh. It's straight, little little straight edge is there. Yeah. Just curve it out. Just curve her, girl. Just get some, yeah. curve her, girl. Let, let, let me do a PSA real quick, okay? Yeah. Okay. Let's hear For it. women out there, uh, you, mm-hmm. you don't need to get rid of the entire eyebrow to the point where it's completely gone. It looks, you know, just a little. You know, leave, leave, leave a little bush up there. We don't mind the eyebrows, you know. You don't have to have a little fucking line. What the what? Wait, what the fuck is just happening? What is going on? This movie has taken it. Whoa! How did he, he just? What? How did he? What? He ended up in his glass. <laughs> how did he transfer into a glass? Yes. What is this fucking Christopher Nolan direct this or something? I, this is, yeah. This is man, maybe this is this was like the uh, like he saw Kazam. He's like bloody hell. There's a kid inside a glass. I'm gonna have me have that me in my movie one day. We're going to go eat a tangerine. Where you just suck it? <laughs> the size of a tangerine. That kid's dick was the size, the size of, of a tangerine. tangerine. <laughs> Let's murder him. Let's get it's, some guns and murder him. Let's kill your dad. Or kill the guy who's trying to kill your dad. Oh, there's the logo. Yeah. Oh. That I saw on the there badge. Yeah. The X Men logo on the wall. So was this a wish that he gets wished to be in the room where his dad was just snuffed out? Yeah, sure. Okay. Why not? I feel like he blew all the wishes. You're blowing me. You're blowing me, Max. I wish you I could fix fun. this fucking tooth. Oh, yeah. Man. That would have been one of my wishes, too. I mean, just fix my girl a little bit. Oh. oh okay, what did you just wish? I wish you went away. Run away! What a dick of a kid, man. I, I mean, know. he's got a problem and uh, can easily fix it because you know he has a fucking genie with him. Yeah, you can do anything you want. You just decided to make stupid, you know, Next decisions. <laughs> Back to school, bitch. Whoa! Damn, boy. He got a big ass butt. Is that a woman or a man? I don't know. It looks like Shaq. Looks like a man dressed as a woman. Yeah, it's Medea. Medea. <laughs> Wonderful. She's got a little Baba Gadu. She's got a little chicken curry. This girl curry. wants to throw up. We all do. Do you eat a lot of Indian food? You know, we were just talking about this the other day. Um, oh, really? Huh. Yeah, believe it or not, just talking about this the other day. Um, probably had it once or twice. Not not very often. I would like to yep. maybe get more involved with it. His Indian food didn't look very good there. Like, I've had good Indian food, but that it, food didn't look seem, it didn't seem very good. Well, look, somebody made that at the craft services real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like she fixed her eyebrows a bit, too. Yeah, yeah she got the tweezed uh-huh. up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. She tweaked them. She listened. She listened. That's, I'm happy. I'm happy yeah. she's listening. I'm, I'm, I'm glad, too. This kid's rocking the rollerblades. Hey, hey, this is my kind of guy. <laughs> okay? <Yeah. laughs> this is my kind of guy. This is my motherfucker. This guy, right can, this guy can walk where he wants to yeah. or roll where he wants to. You have to wear he's, another fucking bike. Oh, he's, like, stealing his bike. This is the first time the mom actually wants to uh, pick the kid up. I think it's like the first time the mom's like left the house in like five I was years. Say, she's been stuck in there too. <laughs> it's like you ain't going anywhere, honey. This is between me and my boy. He's a I man like, now. I feel like this is the scene from like a Kindergarten Cop where he like takes his. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's kind of got the same suit and everything too. That's like a, that's like a dark fucking scene right there. I was just training day. I thought this felt like training day for a second.
I never knew what to think. It's my tooth stuck in my head. Stuck in my fucking head. I can't think. I'm an adult. I had sex. I had you. You're my problem. I want to tell you something, son. If I could do this again. So now he's just going to leave him on the side of the road in New York City. Yes, in the big, scary city. Did you ever, did you ever leave you on the side of the road when you were like acting like a little fuck? My parents? Yeah. Nah. Your dad. I mean, dad, your mom, aunt, uncle. No one just left me on the side of the road. No. <laughs> no I was unlucky. No. I don't like this kid. You would have learned the ways of the world. Plus, I had nice teeth, so, you know. Yeah. It's, I mean, they, 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 put in, they would have liked you on the side of the road. Nice pair of teeth like you have. Thank you. I appreciate that. You're welcome. I think that guy was looking at a porno on the street. <laughs> I think they didn't realize. I have the best porn. I think they didn't realize the guy was looking up at a pinup or no. some kind of centerfold. It looked like when he when he got out of the car in the mirror there. I got got a look all around you, making a kids movie. You never know. You got to be careful. You never know who's going to be out there being creepy. It's a black man. It's a it's a black man with a boombox. <laughs> I can't <laughs> believe it. A black man with a boombox in New York City, of all places. New York City? Got it. Yeah, yeah, you die somebody. So have we, have, we, have we still not figured out what this guy's into? Like what his... Uh... Well, he's, he's, he's an organized crime, but he's become infatuated with the genie and... Uh, okay. He wants, he wants the genie. He wants the genie. He's like Jafar in Aladdin. Exactly. He is the Jafar. The Jafar. No. Okay, so and meanwhile. He's, he's the like kid. living at home. He likes living in his weird, like. Um, blank man. Uh, uh, blank man ass. Yeah, hideout. Lair. <laughs> Subway lair. <laughs> it's fucking best. Blank man and meteor man. Those are two. I Classic. prefer those over this. Yeah, I love it. Because I am now a hip hop artist. Man, that, that's what's happening. Kazam is just—he's being like pimped out. He's being um. How do you say when you're uh? I think it's gone to his exploited. head. Exploited. Yeah. Put your hands together for the Kazam man. He just lets people handle his fucking his boombox, yeah. Boombox like that. Yeah. Ooh. What what is it? Man. Hey, hey. Leave me alone. This kid's gonna wish for something. Oh. Wait. What was that? What was the move the kid just made? I don't know. It was like, I he was going to break dance. Yeah, I thought he was too. Was... That kid is really acting right now. I'm, I'm impressed. He's bringing it. He's bringing the heat. He's earning the checks. Yeah. You know, because in the Cut future, the this, this movie is going to... It's going to be a check in the mail for Kazam. Uh, Kazam. Yeah, you want to stir in Kazim. Yeah. yeah. Imagine if you had... Who, who else would you wanted to have in this movie besides Shaquille O'Neal as a magical rapping genie type fellow? Uh, maybe Mel Gibson as a racist genie. There you go. Hey, kid, it's, it's the Jews, I'm telling you. <laughs> Listen, sugar tits. Yeah, sugar tits. The Jews are the ones that put me in this lamp. Yeah. The Jews. The Jews. I own them. You don't own anything. They own you. He's kissing his nipples. You gotta let that happen, Shaq. <laughs> Can Go I on. kiss your nipples? Grown man, kiss your nipples. <laughs> Oh, oh no! You Is that where he gets his power? You have penetration. 
the 20,000 year old boom box is where he gets his power. Mm. Must be uh, Energizer. <laughs> it keeps going, and going, going, and going. Man, he loves the diesel. Well, Gee, I don't know. It's New York City, just letting shit, you know, <laughs> yeah, you, be by itself. You should know better than that, Jack. Oh, it's going to be all rubbed down. I'd be fine with that. Yeah. That's my wish. To be rubbed down? Give me a rub- There's a Pepsi again. There's a Brock Pepsi. Placement. Pepsi Cola. Jesus, this is fucking WB movie or something. Yeah. <laughs> Look at I have. <laughs> boombox. I have the Boombox. You ever seen Boombox? It's a shitty Boombox. <laughs> It makes no sense that this is a genius boombox, but okay. <laughs> Just go with it. Malik. Of course his name is Malik. Oh, he bitch slapped him. He just gave a backhand for the ages. What is he? What has he got in his hand? A bowl? A dog bowl? Like it was either that or a very, very tiny top hat. Killed him. <laughs> he killed fucked him. that guy up. His, <laughs> his biggest weakness is rubber. Rub. <laughs> That's a lot of a lot of people are this not doing that way. I can't wear a condom. I'm allergic to rubber. Not even goat. Not even goat skin or lamb skin. Goat skin play work better though. I we'll use a Snickers wrapper though. Yeah. Hmm. I like a bounty bar actually. Nice bounty bar. Zero is where my, oh, where I think, uh, if you can find a good zero, yeah. done. It's, it's hard to find those. Oh, Walmart. They usually have Walmart. Uh, the cast registers right next to this. Oh yeah. I mean, I mean, it's like, yeah. Cause they, nobody puts condoms up by the register. They always put the candy bars. Yeah. I was talking about the zero candy bar. Oh yeah. yeah. We I got want, 99 want, cents store. They usually have. I mean, I, I want, I want zero feel feeling. With my candy bars. I totally agree. No fuel. Oh, yeah, Jesus. That tooth came in handy. Scotty, yeah, there you go. Now we get why. A little, you thought uh, he was a zero bar. Yeah. Well, uh, and he's really, he's really bringing it, huh? He's bringing the heat. It's an asshole genie. He's, he's, he's serving everybody right now. I would be annoyed if I just heard a kid screaming in my ear all the time. Just yeah, I mean, it's all been happening for the last hour. Yeah. This this father knows say he's a he's a he's he's man. He's, he's good and good. Yeah. He's holding his own weight. He is. I know. I keep he's feeling like, like he, because it's so venereal. Wait. Was that a fucking violin player? <laughs> it was. It was like the Revenge of the Nerds. I was gonna say do you imagine uh, what's his name Lamar as the genie in this Lamar. Stuff? yeah the black the, bl- the gay black oh, everybody clap your hands together because it's me and this tiny white boy and we're going to serve your ass a lot of similarities revenge in there. quite a bit actually yeah. A much, a much, a much older, you know, uh, man uh, being pretty much in love with a much younger uh, white child. Oh no, no, no! Now they're doing reggae. This is all over the place. Uh, this is this movie has fallen off. A, ha ha! Sinister fuck! What a sin! Oh, Eric, it's gonna have to kill you then. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this was in a contract. I'm gonna go with this was in the contract. I, yeah, it's like you have to spit 16 bars, Shaq, in order to earn that paycheck. What? Well, well, I mean, I honestly think Shaq went home the night this premiere and said, "Yeah, I'm gonna be the biggest fucking star." Yeah. Here, pretty much. I am Kazam. Oh no! Drop the mic. 
Okay, so the easy way to just have somebody not have witches is just to kill them. Right. The easiest way to do uh, that little effect is throw some peanuts up, some packing yeah. peanuts. <laughs> just throw packing peanuts everywhere. And slow it down and ramp up and yeah. There's some, there's, there's some, there's some good. Uh, what do you call it? There's some good ingenuity in this uh, film. Effect wise, the, the old tricks. The old tricks of the trade. The old trickaroo. Now you're going to have to have your way with Max. That motherfucker's Max. dead. Yeah. <laughs> well, this movie took, this took a dark turn. It took a very dark turn. That motherfucker's dead. He he has no icy hot packs that can fix his ass. <laughs> Not even the general insurance can save this guy. Well, what about Papa John? <laughs> <laughs> he wish he landed on a Whoa. Papa John's. Whoa. Man. Wait. So he was gonna kill this guy, basically. He could rip parts out. <laughs> he was gonna rip. He was gonna. He was gonna uh, Kalima him. Molaram. Ooh. Oh, not my ball sack. Oh no, not my dick. <laughs> oh. No, this. I, I feel like this movie gives air of people like the wrong, like just. You know, well, this is nine. What did we say? 95, 96? 96, yeah. yeah July 96, yeah. So, this is before uh, things really hit the fan. Yeah, this is before things really took a turn. Not too far off. No, I mean, a couple within, years. Within five years, things just really t- just, you know, another level. So, what happened there? They, they, he was losing his power um, because. He was losing his power, him. but then he got really angry and got his power back. Ah, yes. Okay. That yeah. makes sense. So that's how, you know. I feel like if you're a genie, you could just kill these guys. Like, that guy's dead. Yeah, you do like a snap of the fingers. Yeah. Type deal. No, they could grab that guy's tush. Well, that's totally uncalled for. Yeah. Don't worry. In, oh. In 15 years, he's going to be bringing that back up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one time on the set one time on the, the set classic of a, hit child's film his pinky up my asshole oh no oh. not next to all the uh, kerosene yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did the kid die <laughs> I don't know if he's killing them or not is this going to be like a movie where the kid just like fell on a box of mattresses or did the kid yeah. actually die and the only way to get him back is to like genius. wish him back to life or something yeah like, like what's going to happen oh. with Avengers Endgame maybe yeah he's just going to snap it back into existence yeah yeah so you want to where say where is that? my love slave Max <laughs> I wife. literally can't my understand your <laughs> accents I cannot and plus you know choking me is not really helping yeah. the uh, yeah the hearing of you gotta rip this guy's leg off oh my god wait whoa gotta get a basketball scene in there somehow base jam uh very saddam husseini that guy good thing it wasn't uh what who it's who kinda, it's kind of rough right there seeing that like yeah he, he this is a child's oh. film, right? He just compacted him into a bowl. And just, just killed him and threw murder him. Murdered man. Yeah, he murdered that man. I mean. Oh, her name's O'Neill? Oh, like April? Oh, man. Or. Yeah. Is this. Wait. <laughs> wait, is this the same. crossover? If it's, in, if it's in New York, I mean, the, the turtles could be under the sewers. Could be. The turtles might come out right now and save this kid. I'd be okay with that. In fact, I mean, this would make this movie absolutely <laughs> fucking amazing. <laughs> this movie was it O'Neill because it was Shaq. Shaquille O'Neal. Oh, O'Neal. Man, there's, yeah, I don't know. A lot of O'Neills in here. So many ways we can go about this. Yeah. Now is uh, the Shazam here going to fix this problem? He's going to go on Maury and he's going to find out he is not the father. Uh, <laughs> Do that, do that good old dance and everything like that. They're is the kid gonna... dead? I think the kid's dead. Uh, the kid is dead. The kid took a tumble down the uh, elevator shaft. Yeah, it's quite a quite drop. Yeah. The only way to fix this is just screaming. It's to sacrifice yourself. Yeah. You sacrifice your last wish for that white boy. Hmm. 
It's because you've been stuck in a fucking but this, boot box. But, but this kid treated you like shit the entire movie. He treated us all like shit. Even the viewers like shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I feel like shit. I mean, I'm not happy with it. No. You think this is what happens in the Shazam movie? Uh, maybe. Yeah. Treats it like shit. It treats fucking Shazam like shit the entire movie. And that's why Mark Strong has to come down. Isn't Mark Strong in that movie? Mark Strong is in that movie. Oh, yeah. All right. All right, so Mark Strong. Mark Strong is like, well, you know, uh, Green Lantern was shit, but I have a good feeling about this one. <laughs> was it was it Mark Strong and Green Lantern as well? He was. He was the best part in that movie. Oh, my God. <laughs> Which? I feel like Mark Strong's in a lot of weird comic book movies. You know what? I respect that, man, because he just does it for the paycheck, right? I, I, yeah, he's cut the check. He cut, be in this cut the thing. bloody check. Yeah, sure. Fuck it. Wait, what's happening here? Oh, the uh, the boy is being uh, the boy merged. is mine. It's like now you are a genie. <laughs> Ooh, you were faking the whole time. You f- oh, kiss him. Well, wow. probably didn't need that. Yeah. Oh, oh no, oh. Now I could be a real rapper. Now you're going to be a real man. (laughs) Oh, but you did. Hmm. Listen, idiot. You made a wish, right? You made a wish. Relieved? I feel like I just took a giant shit. Like a big Chipotle shit. <laughs> I had too too much sofritas in my uh, in my uh, Chipotle bowl, and uh, this is the end result. I know that feeling. Get this, get this kid a new vest. <laughs> Please wish for new clothes. Oh my god, it's a giant shack face. Oh fucking, it's uh, Zordon. <laughs> <laughs> Rangers. Rangers. Help me make. Help me. Make some drugs. <laughs> Let's cook. Let's make some meth. The power. Oh, preschool. A Popeye French. Or John, uh, Papa John's French. Papa John's. Papa Papa John's. Papa John's. Papa John. Papa John's. Oh. God damn it, kid. Wait, Reebok? Oh my God, that is. A, a sh- I mean, it makes sense. So Shaq had some good shoes. He had some Reebok. He was a had sh- some Reebok. He was a Reebok spokesperson. Was he? Before he got his own line of uh, shoes at the old uh, Payless uh, shoe store. Oh, yes, and that worked out so well. Oh yeah, Payless still. Well, they get their money up front, so. Oh yeah. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> doesn't, doesn't matter how many shoes we sell. Already got paid, motherfucker. Oof. Is that his father who's a fireman? He's a fireman. So that mom and dad are going to get divorced. Ah. Your mom's allowing well, me to I had your sex no. with your mom, and uh, I don't have to sleep on the couch anymore. Mm-hmm. Isn't that wonderful, Max? Now when I ask for anal, you know, your mom says yes. So everything's okay. We're not getting a divorce because no. now I can go in her butt. That, that was in my uh, uh, prenuptial agreement. <laughs> Put it in the butt. Were you with that black man again? Pre butt tool agreement. You're all right. You're okay. Yeah, fine. You're gonna be a man one day. You're Don't gonna worry. be one day. One Just, day. I'm gonna, one day. I'm gonna be your mom. <laughs> one day. One day when your mom's gone, I'll be your mother <laughs> and your father. <laughs> and we'll live happy ever after. We'll you get just buried. gotta wish for it. You just gotta ask Shaq for that last wish. Hey, it's your other father. My two dads. That was a good show. Wait, was it the fi- was it that her wait? I think the firefighters are fuck buddy and this is the real father. I was gonna this say he didn't want to kiss her when he left or anything. Free. I would I would, uh, It worked. You gave me a second chance. You gave me a second chance, Max. You're a good kid. You're a right. good kid. I like you. I, I don't really face. think you're mine, but you're a good kid. No. Thanks. I mean, told, at least your mom told me you would. You, you literally could have been a billionaire, but thanks for the second chance. Yeah. 
That's a, okay. That's, that's your grandfather. <laughs> We're all family. I'm a criminal. He's a <laughs> cop, and he's a firefighter. And that's your brother over there. <laughs> and your mom's really your brother. <laughs> when I come back from getting, you know, plugged Throw a ball around. Yeah. Ah, fishing. He went with the shit. See, I was thinking baseball. I think I he was, was going baseball, but he went with the fishing. Yeah, we're going to go play with our rods together? Go fishing? Yeah, you know. It's New York. We'll go fishing. Yeah, go you know, the East River, you know. Because that's what you do. Because that's fucking clean. <laughs> you throw a fucking ball around, but yeah, we'll go fishing. <laughs> so now he's just kind of walking away with the cop into the sunset. Arrested. He's getting arrested. Apparently. I've never seen somebody get arrested that way by just being escorted off uh, <laughs> Off the stage. What did he do wrong? <laughs> there was a fucking fire. He was, he was fucking her out of the fire in a, in a, in a fiery building. Hey. I love you. Come on. You're coming or what, you motherfucker? Hey. We're getting pizza. You're talking to me? You're talking to me? All right. All right. I'm accepted. All right. Now we're we'll fine. Sex with your mom again. Yeah, we're going. We're going. We're going to be okay. It'll be fine. You can videotape it, you know. Kids in your cameras. I, I was never a big fan of this whole like thing when like you get out of a fire. The last thing I want is like a blanket on me. You see that a lot of movies where they get yeah, I mean, a blanket on you. I mean, it's not really cold out, right? It's like yeah. Oh, well, look at that. He's got a nice, like a nice iced coffee. Here. Now, last time I was in New York, and I saw like a nice little coffee. Uh, yeah, I said I got the sewer on, on the sewer. Uh, fucking, uh, plate. Yeah. On a manhole. <laughs> a manhole. That's very appetizing. Mm-hmm. Get real, man. Get out of my face. Yeah. Uh, uh-huh. Now you have to deal with her. That fucking tooth. That tooth is bothersome. <laughs> Can we digitally alter this movie? Oh, and- God. I mean, it's, it's not even like one of those things where it's like, oh, that's adorable. It's like, no, this kid's old enough to know his tooth is fucked up. It's his career, man. Yeah. Come on. It's my kid. I knock his fucking teeth out. Yeah. So, hey, let me do you a favor, you fuck. You want to be an actor, son? You want to be an actor? Have an act, act through this. Two o'clock, meet me in the garage with a baseball bat. Because <laughs> <laughs> my son will be in a movie. Like that. Capra. Frank Capra? Yeah. Yes. Ellie Walker. Frank. So, yeah, he's, uh, he's yeah, a ten. Z Dog was Jonathan Carrasco or Carrasco. We got Rambo in this movie. Oh, yeah, Juan Rambo. And Spin, the Spin Doctor. Apparently, Key was played by three different people. I guess that was the, the that uh, those well, yeah, three uh, those three singers. I guess. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Additional gang kids: Miguel Escobar and Hector Jimenez. <laughs> Which what roles have you done? Well, I was an additional was, gang member. Gang yeah. Or gang member, sorry. Ooh, gangbanger one or two. Uh, <laughs> Does it really matter? <clears throat> Motherfucker, you. Well, that was, that was something. That was a special treat. To, Did uh, you enjoy that? I feel good. Yeah, I feel, oh, I feel great. I feel great. Tugged it out, rubbed it out. We, we usually watch these movies that no one's heard of. Yeah. A few people might have heard of this one. Well, this one definitely. You know, that's what I'm saying. You know, we watch uh, you know, Hard Ticket to Hawaii and, you know, uh, Hard Target and whatnot. Uh, a lot of hard movies, usually. Yeah, a lot of hard. We've been doing a lot of hard. Yeah, we're going hard. Very hard for a lot of hard. Mm-hmm. Going a little but, soft uh, here this time. Hard to kill. Oh, yeah, hard to kill. Yeah, hard to kill. Uh, but Kazam, yeah. you know, got yeah. to switch it up a little bit. Yeah. And when you bring in the alcohol like we did and uh, – yeah. You sit down and you watch a little Shaquille and you'll try to act and uh, yeah. give it the fucked up tooth. Mm, the fucked up tooth. The star of the show. Not too shabby, right? Best supporting tooth. I think so. I, some of the best teeth I've seen on, on screen in you know, years. I mean, yeah, have you seen a tooth like that in a motion picture? Fuck no. Lately? No. You usually got to pay for that type of stuff. Oh, uh, yeah. Usually. Usually you got to di- digitally alter that shit. Mm-hmm. Nowadays. You know. Sometimes you got to digitally alter a mustache. Now you sure. can really alter a tooth. Well, <laughs> well, man, the special effect. No, the, the, all the special effects were used on uh, Shaquille O'Neal's uh, giant um, hiding his dick, <laughs> Tuck, tucking the dick back, tucking the dick back. wrap it around you a few times. Yeah, just, yeah like a con- cabin boy. Over your shoulder. Yeah, it's all Matthew, Matthew Cabin, cabin boy. boy Berkson. Yeah, 
I see you got Camo Boy on your uh, yeah. your roster over there. Yeah. <laughs> Cabin Boy, that was another movie. I, I think I that like was on that the, movie. Yeah, Chris Elliott. Yes, that was on the 12 pack. That was on the 12 pack? That's on the 12 pack, yes. I feel like this 12 pack is I've well, never worth, well worth. I'll the send you a link. Paid. I'll send you a link. I'm a, I'm a big fan of Cabin. Cabin Boy is fun. Yeah, and don't, I've never watched it. And oh, I've boy. It, watch I mean, it. That needs to be the next uh, film, maybe. Yeah, but I might watch it. That's the thing. I think it's one of those movies you watch and you enjoy. It's a goofy movie, right? It's a goofball movie. It's it's silly. It's this is a goofball a, movie kind it's of. It's yuck yucks in it. Yeah, yeah. I see. I see what you're saying. This movie is unintentionally funny. Yeah, this movie. I wonder what the uh, the take in was. Uh, the take for this? I see the budget. This was a twenty million dollar estimated budget. Oof. Okay. Opening weekend. Uh, made seven million opening weekend. Gro- it, it grossed eighteen. Uh, awesome. well, mostly 19 we'll say 19 we'll and round it up to 19 okay probably, maybe it did better on a on a video uh, when it when it hit the uh the, the rental the rental the, you know once it went into a block the blockbuster hey look chris got a special thanks for answering the call thank god i don't know what call it was i would have hung up it's a big fucking call <laughs> big fucking call from shazam himself i bet it was uh kobe called oh I bet kobe scoby you, you think put that's that how he answers his phone? Does, does he go like, Kobe? Kobe. No, I think Kobe. he goes, not Shaq. Not Shaq. Kobe, not, not Shaq. Shaq. I get lifted, performed by the Barrio Boys, featuring Fat Joe. Oh, Fat Joe. Yeah, Fat Joe. You know, he's the lean back guy. He's the fat one, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's the fat. He's the fatter one. You know? Oh, look at the Backstreet Boys. Boys will be boys, performed by the Backstreet Boys. Got some, uh, I got some Shaquille O'Neal. I guess so. Oh, this this is this is quite the soundtrack. It's got a lot of uh, you know, people that you know from the uh, from the nineties of uh, R and B and hip hop. Yeah, your classics like you know Shaquille O'Neal and uh, yeah. Shaquille O'Neal. Yeah. So Shaquille O'Neal had a record label called Twism. You know what Twism meant? Ooh, I you know I don't think I want to guess that one now. No, I'm okay. afraid I come off your Twism. Twism. What do you think it means? The world is mine. Oh. Yeah. It's like so it's like tomorrow never dies. Kind of, and, yeah. Uh, I see. I see what they did. Or if yeah, the world is not enough. Twine. Another day. Yeah, twine. Yeah. World is not enough. Distributed by Disney Pictures, basically, right there. Bona Vista. Yeah. What a classic. I always usually got excited about that touchstone pictures logo there when I it's great. I know it's it was usually it's a time. classic. Yeah. I have a feeling we're going to get like a phone call. Hey, we're putting the Blu-ray together for Kazan. Can we use your movie commentary? It's like, my, we, nothing would give us more pleasure. Than uh, yeah, what Kazan Sam said, grab my belly and make a wish. Yeah, rub it. Just rub it out. He rub said, grab all. my belly. <laughs> he grab my belly. Grab that grab ass. Belly, make a wish. Grab my belly and stroke my dick. There you go. Very nice. Mm-hmm.